Hi, I wanted to do this quick video to explain and clarify because it is my duty to warn um, and prove all things that I'm not subject by use. The codes that I have exposed are to expose what a colorable law is under 18 USC 242, 245, 247. They are to dismiss me from against applying the color of law to my life. They have no authority to intimidate me with their codes. It's a historical record in the paper that I uh, copyrighted our name so that they cannot be used for usury anymore. Okay, we have our Religious Freedom Restoration Act. Uh, you know, I have the right to believe what I want. So that's my PowerPoint of law, my demand for accommodation under uh, Vienna uh, Article 27 and 36. So I'm the extreme elective, okay? And it, to, to be, it's my request for to be admitted for admission and written in the law, my private agreement, there is no charge in reading the scripture. Deuteronomy 1 17, 10 17, 2 Samuel 14 14, Matthew 22 16, Romans 2 11, James 2 and 9, 1 Peter 1 17, Matthew 18 15 through 20, Acts 10 through 34. So, my Lord and Savior, my Creator and Savior, who is the minister with a small m, which is an action not a pro not a noun with a capital m matthew 6 24 so international treaties you know is my insurance and and they are not covered if they violate my faith with their assumption and presumption contracts that violate my belief are rendered null and void the superscription image of caesar rendered to caesar what is caesar's the silver shekel was of Christ of the temple. So I'm not under their subjection. They, 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 they take the, the, the silver shekel with the denarius. Okay? So I don't want to use false God's money. I keep telling them, you know, I want the backing of the uh, real money of Christ. The real gold and silver. Haggai... 2.8 says the gold and silver is mine. The the uh, Israelite, the real creator's money that does not have the image of Caesar. And all debts were paid in the public and in the private because Christ paid all debt. Okay? So I'm not supposed to be under colorable artificial laws and not be intimidated. They need to dismiss dismiss any I'm putting claims against the surety bond to expunge the record this is aiding and abetting this is criminal activity violating my rights there to hold my faith harmless so my request for admissions is I put my ad in the paper as a private agreement process and I there's needs to be damages paid of being unlawfully held and uh, hospitalized and in prison. A person is a capitalized fiction. I'm no respecter of persons. Okay, Romans 2:11, 1 Peter 1:17. The statutes and codes and policies are are applicable to persons, so they can't dispute it with me that it doesn't apply to me. I am not an all caps person fiction i have unincorporated my lien and levy on my soul they stamped the sole of my foot on that form when i was born and gave it to the vatican pope they cursed it with the blood of a bull in a papal bull out over on wall street that doesn't apply to me matthew 5 25 says you know, to agree with thy anniversary, to make an agreement, you are only to pay one farthing, one penny, according to the scriptures, anyway. Okay, so I'm witnessing every word may be established. I, my live life claim, proof of life claims that me and my begotten sons and daughters were born, not birthed. That was to establish the truth, the fact. 
Okay, doesn't the sun rise in the east and set in the west? You can't dispute that. So the legal ad prospectus, they call it, uh, red herring, red post flag, clarification, copyright, copy claim, so that they cannot use our names for usury anymore. That was my private agreement statement, okay? They're violating my rights and they're to hold my faith harmless, okay? The, you cannot harm laymen. So in whatever way my relatives are laymen that have not studied, because we are to prove all things. So I've had to study. That's why I claimed non-hate convention international rights, because people got incorporated, and the hate convention is incorporated with these international bills of lading ship laws under 22 CFR 92-12 to 13 and 49 USC section 1403. I'm not dead and lost to sea. I'm not going to have one foot in the grave and one foot, you know, in the the way, the truth, and the life. Okay? So, um, I demand my accommodations that it be written in the law, my request for admissions, my private agreement, there is no charge. The scripture says that all debt was paid. Christ paid for all my sin and debt. Debt means sin, okay? So uh, when you put an ad in the paper, that is an his, a historical record, okay? And in the boys' paper in McCreary County in January of 2021, to January of or February of 2021 for three or four weeks I ran ads with my name my sons and daughters names my grandson's name for a hundred and fifty dollars it costs me okay and all laws are statewide and congruent in every state it doesn't matter what state what county whatever that was a legal ad notice you can check the paper, the voice paper, and I let the courts know, the federal court in London, Kentucky, the McCreary County Court in Whitley City and Pinot, Kentucky, They're, they run both, uh, and in the Montgomery County Court, and in the Supreme Court uh, in Washington. Uh, and many other courts, okay, that were given a copy of that legal ad so that they cannot use my name, my son's and daughter's name, my grandson's and granddaughter, our relative for com their commercial user. My YouTube videos, I didn't make any money from them. I published what I have for free of charge to the people to save people's souls with the truth I haven't made any international monetary funds demonetized funds off of my videos okay so um Acts 10 34 uh, you read these scriptures Matthew 6 24 1 Peter 1 17 James 2 and 9 Romans 2 11 Matthew 22 16 2 Samuel 14 14 Deuteronomy 1 17 and 10 17 uh, Matthew 18 15 through 20 Romans 2 11 1 Peter 1 17 Matthew 5 25 and on okay so um I, like I said, I'm not going to be intimidated, intimidated by colorable law. 18 U.S.C. 241, 242, 245, 247. I'm not going to be intimidated with their all caps, fictitious name, 18 U.S.C. 341, 342, 911. I said I'm Jane Doe to that. Dead on entry to your 
broken system. I know about the Brady Bill and the crime bill, which is the mark of the beast that you did on the people. And you're not going to label me and my sons and daughter with the mark of the beast. I claim my innocent name, and I am innocent, and they are innocent. Revelations 2.17. And the, the superior name is real, because we are real, real Isaiah 44. And no weapon formed against me shall prosper. I shut the mouths of my enemies and those who speak against me. Should any tongue rise against me in judgment, they themselves will be condemned. This is my righteous heritage. And the I am that I am, the great I am. What Moses, Messiah was told in the, told in the burning bush. I am that I am, the great I am. And I am not liable. Liable. Box 1A, not libel, okay? So all of your insurrections, infringement, I have tried to do all the due diligence that I can to free myself and my sons and daughters. I have focused on this for years and, and spent so much of my time and energy in whatever funds I had to try and free my family of Satan, of evil, of demons, of devil, of wickedness, of lies and deceit, of, of, of free us from these political wars that are killing people, religious wars that are killing people, racial wars that are killing people, taxes that are killing people, people, the Roman Empire, the Greek Empire, the Egyptian Empire, all of the, the Chinese Fungu, ba, ba, ra, amen, Raman banking, all this illegal, unlawful, terrible, criminal, human trafficking. It's exposed under 5 U.S.C. chapter 54 that they have been human trafficking. Hugh is the sh shadow of a man. Two, I am a real feminine living woman, not a corporation, not a corporate fiction. Okay, so I have done everything to the best of my knowledge to free me and my family of all lies and deceit. And Matthew 5, 25, if you understand the scriptures, it says to agree with thy adversary quickly. It says that you will be delivered up before the judge and that if you will pay to the fullest farthing, well, one penny, okay? So does that mean when you go before a magistrate or judge, you're supposed to say, well, here's your penny, okay? Here's what belongs to Caesar or your money or whatever. Where is my shekel? Where is my silver shekel? Where is what belongs to to the creator and the savior the one archetype they call jesus christ yeshua hashaya the more ancient hebrew name okay do you understand i hope you people understand and i'm part of me that i have gotten angry and have cussed and swore and had ambivalence in some of my other videos but i am fed up because i have put so much of my time and effort and energy and studying to get free to like Moses Messiah said to Pharaoh I don't want to be on your fares or on your rows your row row boat let my people go let me and my family go my relatives all his relatives for justice J-U-S-T hyphen U.S. Us. Okay? I can't help what other people don't know and know. I have published videos for years for free whenever I learn publishing more to help other people learn. Okay? So, thank you for listening. My private agreement is is my allegiance is to me and my my family my, my relatives my blood heirs it's not to a flag it's not to uh 
you know, your beliefs. My name and my fam, my relatives, we have our own nation, our own country, our own kingdom, queendom of heritage, heritance on this earth. I came to give you life that you would have it more abundantly on earth as it is in heaven, as the scripture said.